She's playing country music. Oh, yeah. And buying ice. That's right, about 20 bags. Okay, I've seen this before. You're cooped up for a long time, away from home, under a lot of stress. You begin to imagine things. I'm not imagining anything. I heard him screaming. Then their lights flickered. And he hasn't been seen since. Uh -huh. It's not exactly a slam dunk, is it? Well, it sure as hell is probable cause. It's only thunder. It's only thunder. It can't hurt you. What do you want me to do? Do your job. Call the sheriff. If I call the local yokels, they're going to want to talk to Monk. I can't allow that. What kind of cop are you? I'm a cop who has his priorities straight, Captain. It's my job to protect that man. What if he's wrong? We'd be blowing his cover for nothing. He is never wrong. Maybe heard something. I don't know, scream. Maybe the TV was all on. Well, why did she lie to me when I called her? You called her? Yes, I called her. It was a local call. It can't be traced. OK. First thing in the morning, I'm gonna go into town and talk to the sheriff. No, 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 no. Tomorrow's too late. She could be getting rid of the evidence right now. That's the best I can do. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna wash up and go to bed. Mom, are you sure? I mean, are you really sure? And don't give me any of that 95% crap. Captain, I am 100% sure that she probably killed him. What does that mean? 95%. Whoa, whoa, hey, I need some privacy here. OK. Take your time.